Yeah, na fail tukua tumishika na mikono, kila mahali, <laughs> na fani kenda shukuli zangu kwa sunny days, kwa mashamba, <laughs> site, <laughs> site visit, yende kani mekushika hivi, ndo muone. Patu wangu, ndo fail, ndo mwema ndo hapa. By the way, sorry by the way, nasinyanga sana by the way. Sometimes nile wezi rudishia mse, yeah. wezi mwambio kwa noe, ati, bluda, wapi fail? Sai na kwanza. Sio ambiambia So utashinda ukiambia wasi each and every day utashinda kuambia hivyo. Really good. I don't know kama ni am I the only one who is suffering from this eh? but I really want to know these are the guys who maybe have ever done something like couple goal kwa online ni. Nataka kujua bahati yakenda mahali na wizangu wameacha kudana. That is what I want to understand. Hai wasa. Sikuona when people see Kabi alone wanakuanga zile za milia kwa api. Una get? Sijua mimi hiyo swali peke yangu ina sinya but Mimi mimi si I think my window maybe ni so ito. Okay for me maybe ni ambiwe maybe ni ambiwe I say hi to you. Kuli zangu mecha happy Pluto. Kana na itse ya de makimisa. Suki yona mahali ni kwa pega yangu nitembea na unataka kuuliza umeacha kufail baada ya kuuliza wewe jua kwa nini ama kwa shukuli zake anaweza kuwa kwa salon anaweza kuwa na ngeza nails so mazi it is not important but para tu mahali hata unisali mimi. Wewe umeacha happy fail. Muda mazi it sucks bana. Si nasema tu bele. Si poa. Ah ya so guys No, kuna hii jingine before even get started. Yeah. So guys, you from the way, um mm-hmm. like uh, there is a friend of Fel uh, who will ask some questions behind the camera, questions that you have no idea about because yeah. we really want to understand what were your concerns um, and what you really want to know about what we have been anticipating to know. Yeah. And before that maybe it's good to clear the air because I don't the last video me Fel and I did together was quite some months ago, more than a month ago, isn't it? Yeah. Um, though this time I should video ya prank ya gari. Makasema mm-hmm. ame crash God, mm-hmm. before you guys start attacking me, <laughs> no, it's good to make the means of clarification so easy. Mm-hmm. So, fell na kwa hapa, ajibu mashtaka, na mimi jibu mashtaka. Mi ajami watu wa nika whole video about it. Haya, nilikuwa ni mesema, like, siya uja perfect driving, ni like, perfect, perfect, sindio? Mm-hmm. So, the deal was, mm-hmm. singe kwa highway. So, the call that I received, ilikuwa ya, nime wangesha gari, mi never knew it was a prank. Sawa, so, ilikuwa ni prank, eh? nime wangesha gari kwa highway. Na uli specify, nime wangesha kwa highway, sindio? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Now, for me, I took it as a matter of, disrespect forget ndo ni visa swali ya kwanza kama na sini kwambia usinde hai na gari yeah. because hiyo ni kitu ingeacha kama nionge ile because there is something that people don't know out there na niko hapa hivi niambia hata maboys wangu huko huko nje that and even girls out there and I even I usually even tell fellow hapa men what they require most is two things that is peace and respect if you respect a man and a feeling you are loved to learn hiyo ndo mademo wazi wengi pale huko nje ukionyesha mwana ume respect yeye huwa na trade in respect na love kwa pamoja So it is always good to respect your man. See that I have to respect even if it was a prank. Do you know what I mean? But he said it was a prank. So they were like left right or center when you were at eh and bona eh ako sawa. Sasa mtu anapiga simu na anaongea mzuri anasema guy ndo imeumia. Sasa mimi ameumia. Unajua watu wali judge sana by the way. Simu imepigwa. Unajua hii kitu ni kama tuchukue mbuzi tuchije vizuri tuangalie shida ilikuwa wapi. Simu imepigwa. Gari imeongezwa, si ndio? Gari ndo imeumia. Mmoja amepiga simu, acha umia. Wewe bati fast but video love nianze kuona comments negative hapa. So guys, let's now get to the bottom of this video. Uh, we didn't want to share this with you. Yeah, so maybe you can follow up on the few questions we've asked mm. and then maybe you you know what this video is about. Sure. Yeah. So, no? mm. Mm. so we have someone behind the camera. She has a few questions to ask. Yeah. Okay, so I'll start. As Felicity and Pluto's fans, we want to know Why didn't you want to announce the pregnancy at an early age? <laughs> so to start with I Ogona mo. Ebu si mama si mama. But uh, maybe first confirm to people mm. whether it is true that you are pregnant or not. What? Yeah. Mm. Mm-hmm. So to confirm. See they can't see me. Mm? <laughs> How many of these can't see? <laughs> so I have to stand. Ngo <laughs> mshere. Mwanikana. Itabidi tu mfanye ile couples kwa sababu it can iko sawa inaona kana mzuri eh ivo mmeona so guys yeah we have different reasons uh-huh. why we didn't want to announce it at the uh, analyst stage eh? mm-hmm. uh my own reasons were um as long as maybe we introduced this couple us to the to the public eh? pia kuna ile nilikuwa nataka ile my you know some some privacy pia ile kidogo unaona because initially actually we weren't supposed to announce this at all yeah initially we weren't until who convinced me she she did and finally i agreed to that now the reason i didn't want uh, uh, us to announce it because uh, i was like kuna couple seeing you probably go social media and once they start dating and uh, wanna they bring everything to the public uh, um who wanna fall ama wanna lean into the side ya kusikiza each and every person who is giving them yeah. advice unaona other people's opinions wanapewa advice na wanapewa advice na wanapewa advice na eventually unakuta 
Dr. Mebreka like today today it's on a Saturday mm -hmm. you've learned of a couple through online mpasho wapi ni rugusi tukaona kuna couple manzi miachana who have been a married couple that has been online and for so long so vitu kama hizo ndizo mimi nitaanisha like hadi naona there is no need kwa sababu sasa ina ina kujanga tena kwa itike kashim to the public i unaona so me was like if it can be done privately this is like this is a family you're talking about this is like it's just not something small here that you are talking about even her initially i go for the idea of we do not announce yeah also initially it was for the idea of not announcing okay so for me um like being a, a social media person and all that you know going outside and uh, meeting with people you know kuna vile msia na kuangalia fani na kuna like hey, it's true you're pregnant ni nini some other person is asking you questions like why haven't you announced to us and things like that so uh, i just wanted to avoid all that yeah yeah so for the question you called again because you don't think we need why didn't you want to announce the pregnant pregnancy before, at an early age uh before i was for the idea of not announcing i think we have the same reason as to why like i preferred keeping it uh private, private yeah so the second question i will start with felicity mm -hmm. is it your first time being a mom <laughs> of course <laughs> how do you feel about it um i'm actually excited i can't wait to meet uh this baby over here and yeah i'm actually excited yeah you know it's like a new a new phase um, a new journey that is going to begin you know now i'll be a mom so yeah it's exciting actually to pluto mm. is it your first time being a dad no it's not my first time being a dad i have 52 kids it's not a joke <laughs> i have 52 kids that can call me a dad you know no 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 no, it's only one that I followed. And I took a graduate. Yeah. See, it's up to one. Oh, so, yeah. My biological. Yeah. Have one biological. Uh, yeah. So, yes. Uh, about to have a daughter. And uh, you guys, my fans, know the story. And why I'm not with her. And why you don't see her. You guys know the story. So, I don't have to, to repeat it. Yes. So, how do you feel about this particular journey with Felicity? I feel good because, you see, anybody in my experience, he grow. No, no. And I also hope and pray that I'm going to to bring up my child, you understand? I provide for the kid and I can see that kid, you understand? So for me, it's a, I would say it's a, like a God-given opportunity and even chance to be a father, yes. I'm grateful to Allah. Okay, the third question goes mm. to both of you. Yeah. Are you tense? <laughs> okay, for me, guy was the first month. I'm in the first trimester. Mm. I'm after, after realizing I was pregnant, mm -hmm. I was so tense. I was so tense. But uh, with time, like uh things got better like that pressure intention you know this is the first time you've been a mother you're being a parent you don't know what was on and you don't know if uh will be if there's so many things you think about yeah so it comes with that tension cut tension plan so yeah of course i was tensed but uh now it's things get better with time yeah mm. Mm. so from my side eh? <coughs> tension doesn't make way because tension doesn't make way you know i'm 22 turning 23 years in <laughs> two days as we shoot this video today is on, today's on saturday 27th and on 29th i'm celebrating my 23rd birthday now you see i'm 22 year old isn't it happy apple jirin namili um we decided to uh, move in together uh <coughs> but not yet married uh then there comes a baby so basically there are so many reasons to be tensed but again uh the one who is above there is bigger than our problems is bigger than our expectations is actually bigger than anything else so, so you just leave Unaishi siku venye iko, unaona? Na naenda hiyo siku nyingine and um, what I can say is that I'm happy. Yeah, I'm I'm, I'm happy. You know me, I actually know the gender but <laughs> she she doesn't know. So we are going to reveal that very soon but myself and so I'm I'm happy. I'm a happy man. Yeah, so tension lazima tension inakuwa. Jo mimi by then unaona kila kitu kiko You know most of the times when you're consumed by work, like uko a lot of work happening, as well you are running errands. Yeah, kama sasa hizi I'm supposed to be rushing somewhere then come back. Unaona? Yaani job job hapo na pale watu wapi traveling so you actually don't even get much to concentrate on the fact that haya wewe kuna mtu yana kama. The only thing you can do is to just sit down and plan for the future. You understand? But ni ile kuna kwa na ile time yenyewe ka feeling flan dugu akana quit. Ana kama unaona? No. The reality now starts dawning on you. Yeah, but then you go unaona. So mimi nasema ni ile to tension ile. So for my fourth question, Pluto you just told us that both of you are 22 years. Don't you feel like you're too young to have a family? Oh, myself? No. When you have old is too young. Actually, earlier today, I was going to tell you about the guy who was there. That guy is my close friend. 
and it's a co- more than 30 billion. And uh, he gave me his dream. That guy married at 21. Because I can one. 21 sana by 25 kijana alikuwa amenipa nini hadi mahali ya ndawa ya this day so um the point is uh, what what are we doing cohabiting mm. dating something called we are dating we are still dating that is the point dating but living together yeah. you understand so uh wajambi by this spendi they cause self control like yangu kutoka na nje like nataka na life naifanyeka at our own pace you understand so i don't think age like here is a factor know, they don't know they mm. will not relate to mm. what's going on between the two of them mm. like sinini tu mmejua vinyo mnataka exactly. and all that your plans mm. and all that so hakuna mm. 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 vinyo msi atakuja kuanzia kuambia so me personally i don't think that age is a factor anyway here kwa sababu kwani wazee wetu walikuwa wanapata watu wengi na watu wengi wacha leo tumechelewa do you think you are too young to be parents what age do you think someone should be a parent okay you can maybe just comment yeah. about the next question yeah. so the other question mm. sisi kama ma fans yeah. tunataka kujua mm. are you stable enough mtawezana kulea mtoto uh, okay there is a saying in asimanga that mtu yuko na sani yake maybe 50% correct and maybe 50% incorrect according to how many people argue about it because eh, some people saying that uh, planning for kids is better because you plan because babu na feel they are enough resources to bring up those kids you can be able to take education cover you know health cover like kuna jiwata mtu akikonjeka kuna cover itaenda kumshughulikia pale ilikuwa kwa course you understand ah pia kuna mwenye ataju mtu yule akikam anakaa na sahani yake mtu yule wa god alright so mimi naweza sema hawa si wote ni kama wanakuanga kila msiko correct na na njia zake in terms of uh, stability eh uh, like stability of financially definitely okay umezo pia inaweza kuwa mentally Ah, <laughs> kuna, kuna mm, okay, yeah. okay. So okay, una jua mtoto anakujanga na sahani yake. <laughs> In case your sahani <laughs> <laughs> So are we financially, are we financially stable? Uh, I don't want to for, don't for my case I don't want to answer it as a yes or no question. Can I answer it as a kiku man? But then you are not what someone going on. Na mara mzembe ni ukweli by the way mimi ndio. And I chose that life and I'm not going to change because of anyone on social media ama anyone online. Eh kuna zaidi na bed na ishika abuda yake. Tunaishika abuda yake. Unajua mimi want to be venye na elewa mwanaume. As a as a man you are supposed to be the head of the family. Una get? Na kuna mali tunasema anga nyesha shingo ifike kupita kupita kichwa and all that. So when it comes to a family and uh, this question is asked about money and uh, all even if fell would have a lot of money to be honest eh? I would still feel challenged as a man I feel like I'm the one who should play a major role when it comes to bills because I'm the I'm the man here you understand like since um, I will engage fell in the question of where can that kid go to school no no but when it comes to finances who is going to pay I'll go there to pay because mimi nime that is how I've been brought up as a man mimi nikilelewa mimi nilifunzwa mwanaume ni ofanya hivi na hivi na hivi na hivi and uh, since kwa sababu nimekuwa mkubwa kwa sababu tumekuja au eh I'm going to present our town and I'm going to change my perspective in how I view a man. So basically, me me sit as I'm financially stable or I'm financially unstable. Do you know why? I'll answer this question. Eh, mm-hmm. uh, naweza afford eh kupeleka mtoto eh uh, kama uh, an example bija prepare for this, ndio? Lakini as for now, I say afford kupeleka mtoto Breban. Sijui kama una get a yes or no question. Someone taking mm-hmm. your kid to Breban is not mm-hmm. because being financially stable. stable. Mm. and to someone else mm. taking them to maybe even another school mm. not even Juja mm. is being just taking a kid to school mm. is being financially stable so, so kuna kitu tangu levels of stability yeah. you understand so that's why I, I cannot answer that question as a yes or no but what i know from whatever god has provided the kid cannot suffer because to be honest i've tried to make investments here here or there and uh, trying to take some uh, insurance covers zile zinaweza saidia hapa na pale jamaa mbona humana ujui kesho itakuwaaje ndio Uh, and so you have to protect the future by trying to invest in the in the future and there are many ways to invest in the future so nime try to say how is it to say catch up some even try try hapa pale and she's also trying her best mm. Mm. so umeanza for both of you yeah. Yeah. She, you have something to say <laughs> i that? think that's mm. enough mm. that's enough for that okay. Okay. so mm. on our last question mm. as we are winding up okay. i want felicity mm. you looked <laughs> <laughs> uh-huh. I want you to look at Pluto mm. and tell him something anything that's in your What? mind. Mm, <laughs> This is I'm going to tell him something. Najaba tukota tu. Yes. Fatukota uh, tu. <laughs> okay, so um I'm excited mm. to uh, take this journey with you mm. and I I'm glad it's you and not me else. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so I'm happy we're doing this together. 
and uh, yeah, I can't wait to see what these people add. Mm -hmm. Thank you guys so much. Yeah, you too. <laughs> <laughs> Pluto, mm -hmm. can you also look at Fel and tell her mm -hmm. anything or something oh, yeah. special? <laughs> 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 yes, yeah, so I'm going to be I love you. Um, yeah, I love you so much. My mom would have done for being here mm -hmm. as, uh, as we continue. Let us know that as long as, I, as, as long as as I live, I'm going to call differences. Eh? This is a good thing. 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 This we must sit down and have a conversation because that is what I have seen our fathers and our mothers do, mm -hmm. our uncles and aunts do. Because uh, me, I don't want the, the only impression. No, no, but you can't control the relationship or something. When there is a problem, bring it up. We make a conversation without involving our fans, you know, without involving you. So that is the point. Eh? Uh, it won't be straight like this. Mm -hmm. So you are a Ghanaian dog. Yeah, but you just know that I love you. But I don't know. But sorry, not in fear of anything. I want you to know that. The child is not going to suffer as long as I am alive. Uh -huh. Yes. Uh -huh. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, thank you guys. Mom, that's that's it. dance. Hmm? Oh, that's the, questions a couple the questions dance. are over. The questions are over. So guys, that's it actually. Um uh, one more thing maybe you can uh, you can say. Mm -hmm. Um as for now because I know there are questions that uh, are going to come. Where the delivery is going to happen, yeah. the resort. So, this is guys, this is the first time mm -hmm. she's having a baby, so mm -hmm. everything is not planned. I would like to plan Siku, Naskia, Kevin, the Ninaka. So, that is your two boys, Zile, Nifangoza, where this sheet is going to go down. Mm -hmm. So, maybe even if you have ideas, or you can, you can, you can bring them in. But we had, we had several places, we had several places in mm -hmm. mind, like at Nairobi, uh, modern, yeah. modern Komaro, we have, Komaro, um, we have RFH in mind. And uh, and other places in mind, eh? but bad though we ha we haven't settled down on any so far. Yeah. Um, so the only thing to go to Kifanya and uh, and uh, thank you to Siron Medical Center by the way. Yeah. Siron Medical Center is a very nice place. By the way, the Unicity 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 Mall, and uh, those guys actually offer the best the best service in terms of. That is where I've been going for my clinics and yeah. scans, scans checkups yeah, and all that. Checkups. And like kila kitu pale manze mi na kongani me. Nime, approve. Nime, nime approve, nime katik. So guys, if you have maybe, nasi yeti ni bol peke yake, mm. kuna vitu kama, mm. meno, ni tango aje, wala wanda kuna dentist, mm. kuna tizi ine, like wakona different departments pare siron, and uh, they are very professional. Yeah, yeah. yeah alafu mm. guys, so mm. I hope you enjoyed this video, and uh, I hope it's a sanction to the Misha, as mm. Misha Isha Le, mm. you know. So in the yeah, next so videos, what you expect to see in kama, maybe maybe she's going now to, without now me being there, yeah. Because I can share the first trimester. No, there's one, one in yeah. two. Together. Uh, mm. I think we call it after realizing mm. I'm pregnant. Like what came, mm. what transpired, and the things mm. I went through yeah, with my friends, mm. how, how I had to announce it to my parents. Mm. The reactions the and your reactions. So you guys just stay, stay tuned, tuned to this channel, Felicity Shiro. And I'll tell you that we're going to have videos. Because I'm going to try it. I think I'm going to post. So it's easy. It's a good job. It's a good job. And so with my blessing, <laughs> do I have to give blessings in this case? Can. With my blessings, everything. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so, guys, that's it. Mm -hmm. yeah, guys, so I'll see you in my next video. Stay tuned.